Hello and welcome back to Funny Megita Jones. We are stuffing my cash envelopes for the last two weeks in January 2023. We are closing out the month with cash stuffings. So if you want to see how that goes, stay tuned. <music> So welcome back, y'all. But first, I wanted to do a little bit of happy mail. Um, uh, yeah, I was I was very surprised to get this. Um, uh, yeah, so I went to go drop off some orders at the post office last week, and in doing so, I went to go check my PO box as I usually do, not expecting to see anything, but just checking just in case. And I got this package, and it says it was from Amazon Prime. I'm thinking. I don't have anything coming that I order from Amazon to my P.O. box because it's a, it's one of them tiny P.O. boxes, y'all. It's one of them baby ones. And I have it just so I can have an address to send out my Etsy orders under. I don't really receive packages there. So when I when I got this and I'm like, what the heck is this? What did I order? And I, well, my P.O. box is not even on my Amazon Prime account. So I was just like, what the heck? So I'm just like, look at this, and I'm walking out of the post office, because usually I just would have put this in my bag and wait till I got home and open. I'm ripping this open, and I'm going, this must be one of them, them Amazon scam things that people be doing, and they send you stuff, and you got to pay to return it, and they get the money. I don't, it, I've heard about stuff in the news. I can't tell you exactly what the scam is, but I was convinced that this was a scam. I'm just like, what is this? What is this? Because I wasn't expecting anything. So I open this up. And I first, before I pull that out, I first look at these receipts. And the first one is, it says, it's a thank you note. And um, it tells me what it is. And I'm just like, well, well what is this? And I go, it, is, it's, it's, it says, it's best based 350 piece number educational toddler toy learning toys for ages three and up girls, boys, preschool, math, games and development i go now i know i didn't order this especially especially on december 29th i go i know i didn't order this this is like how did they get my it's like somebody deliberately sent this to me and i don't know why they did because i don't have any kids and i didn't order this i don't understand what this is then i pull out this receipt it says exactly the same thing and i'm like i still don't know what this is then i see this it's a gift for you and i will read it as such Enjoy your gift. Hopefully this will help fill up your bank. I use prop bills as well. Love your videos. Keep up with your amazing savings. From Leslie. I teared up a little bit, y'all. I did. Because I'm not quite sure who this person is. Leslie, if you're watching, thank you. I don't even, I don't even know what you sent me because I haven't opened it yet because I wanted to save it for this. After I read this, I wanted to save actually what you sent me for this. And I'm no, I kind of know what it is. But I was just like, oh my God. Thank you. Now, um, my father's name is Leslie. So when I saw this, I'm like, Leslie, oh, I turned up spells it the same way too. But Leslie, whoever you are, thank you. Um, thank you for supporting me. Thank you for sending this to me. I, I honestly did tear up because I just thought this was so thoughtful and unexpected. And um, just thank you. Thank you. And I'm glad um, you like my videos. And I'm glad that I am one of the people out there using prop money that can inspire other people to do their budgeting in the way that works for them. Because when I was looking for videos, and I think um, Hands and Bands said this something similar, when we were looking for videos of how we do this without using cash, it didn't seem possible because not a lot of people were doing it. And um, I think I saw one of Hands and Bands videos, that was the first, first video that I saw. So she inspired me to start my channel and start using prop money. And I think I saw one other person that I was finding on YouTube that was using prop money. So um, this is possible. It's possible to do it with prop money. And I know a lot of people follow Dave Ramsey and they're doing the whole cash thing and that's great. I say do what works for you. And if you know you can make strides and, and, and pay off your bills and advance your savings and improve your investments, but you can do it with prop money, do that as well. So I say all to that to say thank you, Leslie. I'm glad you're watching my videos. I'm glad that you're enjoying them. And <laughs> I think you must have watched the cash condenser video which was like, I don't have any money left. So I appreciate you. I appreciate you, all of you. I appreciate all my subscribers, all the people who aren't subscribed but still watch and people who like and support my shop. I appreciate you all. Thank you. Thank you so much. So without further ado, this great little note here, I'm going to 
look at this and I can I think I know what it is but I am I'm so happy when I get extra of this prop money oh my god I'm so excited oh oh okay it's all fancy it's all new bills it's I get so excited with new bills hold on let me get some sizzles let's get so excited so ah! okay 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 Look at this. New money. New money, people. I'm, okay, I'm a little deranged here. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> I'm so sweaty and now. I'm sweating. Leslie, okay, I'm trying not to start a fire here by me throwing all this paper around. Let's just move this out of the way. Hold on, we'll move, move you out of the way. Thank you so much, Leslie. Oh, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Fake money is so pretty. Thank you, Leslie. Oh my God, this will so much come in handy. I am so excited about this. I can't even tell you. I can't even tell you. Can't even tell you. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. This is so exciting. And it looks really new. I mean, like, not really new. It looks really real. There's like no symbols or anything. Of course, it says for most picture use only. But look at that. That's gorgeous. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This will be used. As you can see, I, 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 I need a, as much prop money as I can possibly get. So thank you so much. I really appreciate the thoughtfulness of this gift and, and everything that I've gotten from you guys. I really do appreciate it. And um, Leslie, thank you again. Um, uh, yeah, thank you. That's all I could say. Thank you. So welcome back. Um, I'm showing you my budget planner and uh so far so good i now have some tweaks that i'm going to be changing to this for the next month which is a great thing i like about this whole bullet journaling thing you can change it month to month to suit your needs and i knew i'd be tweaking it from january to february and february to march so um i'm gonna get it like fine-tuned y'all so we are stuffing 380 dollars into my cash envelopes with hopefully if i counted right with the roller over 30 dollars so um without further ado let's get to it Back. As I said, we're stuffing $380 into my cash envelopes. So I'm going to go ahead and count out the money. And if I did my calculations right, we should have $380 here. So we have 151 plus 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, plus 80, plus, oh, plus 20, plus 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, plus 50, plus 5, 10, 15, 20, plus 20, plus 2, 4, 6, 8, plus 8, plus 2, 380, 380, yes! Right on the dot. Okay, 280 right on the dot and put our money in our cash tray how are you all doing y'all if i sound a little funny um i think i'm coming down with something it doesn't seem severe it seems kind of mild i hope it stays this way for the duration of however long it seems to be settling in my body and i hope it clears itself out i hope this is a mild cold but i'm gonna go ahead and get a covid chest just in case because, you know, you just never know. It doesn't feel like COVID, but, you know, it doesn't hurt to get, get, get tested. And so, yeah, there we go. 380, 380, 380. Okay, so let's get to it. <laughs> okay, so we're going to start with Con Ed. We're going to finish funding that. We're going to put $75 into Con Ed. How are you all doing? Um, how, what do you, what do you, how's the weather where you are for the last um, two weeks? And uh, what is it? Today is the 15th. Today's 15th. Um, what are you guys doing for the last two weeks in February? I mean, February. <laughs> Look, I've already jumped ahead. So we've got 50, 1, 20, 40, 45, 50. So we have 150 in Con Ed. Usually by now I will have checked my bill to see what the actual amount is, but I'm hoping 150 covers it. I'm going to be very concerned if it does not. <gasps> Please let it cover it. Okay, Dollar Tree. Then I'll have to just have to put more money in here, and then or I'll just be over. It'll be what it'll be, y'all. It'll be what it'll be. So Dollar Tree, we're putting uh, another $14 in here, and I'm happy to report that I have not gotten Dollar Tree at all this month. So this money will just be rolled over to next month. Yeah! 
so we've got 20, 10, no, I'm sorry, 10, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, $28 into Dollar Tree, which is a nice little chunk of change to have. I don't have anything. I'm trying to think, is there anything I need to get from Dollar Tree? Like necessity wise. I will go, my, my part of my no spin, low spin January is if, obviously if I need it, I will go and get it. But um, the whole point is to not spend excess like on eating out, which is my nemesis. So um, we'll see. We're putting $45 into eating out. And it should give us a whole $90, which I'm very excited about. So next month, um, hopefully we won't spend it all. Okay. Five. Uh, so 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90. $95 in eating out. Very exciting, y'all. Very exciting. This is going to be rolled over until February. Yay! Groceries is getting another 180. 150. Well, that was weird. Um, 70, 80. Okay. That actually shouldn't have been together, but whatever. Whatever. Um, we got one. 150. 70. Okay. One. Two fifty. Wait a minute, wait a minute, what am I doing? One hundred, two hundred, two fifty, three hundred. I don't know why that was so weird. Three hundred and twenty, three hundred forty, three hundred fifty, three hundred sixty. I don't know why that was so hard to count. Three hundred sixty dollars into three hundred sixty dollars into groceries, and I think I've only spent two hundred and sixty of this, so I have a hundred dollars left which is kind of good. We're going to put $18 into Home Essentials. And again, this is different from the Home Binder in my uh, sinking funds because this is basically just toilet paper, you know, um, uh, body wash, all that fun stuff. So 15, 17, 18. Uh, what am I doing here? What am I doing here? What am I doing? Okay. 10, 20, 25, 30, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, $36 into Home Essentials. Very nice. Very nice. This is also going to carry over because I don't plan to shop. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. I have, I'm going to, hopefully I'll mute that out. If, um, I have, um, like I said, I have a bug and I don't, I'm, it's not horrible, but it's not great either. We're going to put um, $18 into Oops, and that's just our miscellaneous folder. So we've got um, 10, 5, 7, 18. Okay. This just should be, a, this is going to be a short video, y'all. Let's see. 5, 10. Did I do that right? Okay. 5, 10, 5, 10, 20, 25, 30, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. $36 into oops. I can make $36 worth of mistakes next month. Spent, we're not going to do anything with that. We're going to take it with the end of the month and we should have $30 again put into our rollover. So, there you go. <clears throat> That's it. Um, I'm going to do my sinking funds separately because um my sinking funds is going to take a little bit of time but um yeah so that's it that was a short and sweet cash stuffing <clears throat> oh and just so you know the spent whatever is in this this spent represents i last month i owed my spent 906 dollars so i decided just to keep it in here until i unstuff everything and um at the end of the month we'll reconcile this with what i actually spent and what was paid and all that fun stuff so um that's what's in spent if you, in case you were wondering so we're pretty much done um yeah so i hope you enjoyed this video my next video is going to be my sinking funds video and after that it's going to be a savings challenge video and uh yeah so i will talk to you soon take care bye, bye.